Process safety in general uh, uh, has been a subject that's been of interest to the industry for quite some time, but uh, lately it has taken a much more uh, sig significant importance because of uh, the impact it has with regard to plants. Uh, uh, operability and sustainability. Uh, in short, what I'm saying is that uh, if uh, uh, chemical plants and refineries are not able to operate their plants safely, they're not going to be sustainable in the long run. In general, in process safety, a new area that has been evolving is the issue of inherent safety. Uh, when we talk about inherent safety, uh, what we are talking about is uh, uh, reducing hazards. There are two ways to look at it. Uh, hazards are the inherent property of a particular chemical. For example, a toxic chemical, the inherent property of that toxic chemical is toxicity. For a flammable, the inherent property is the uh, intrinsic property of it to catch fire or explode. And when we uh, talk about inherent safety, we talk about ways of controlling or reducing that inherent hazard in a way that it reduces the overall risk to uh, people and the environment. As director of the Medicare Counter Process Safety Center, uh, my primary mission, or the mission of the center, is to address uh, uh, research, uh, education, and training I issues related to process safety, which would then translate into improving uh, the chemical safety in the process industry. All of these uh, research areas that we have in the center are focused at learning uh, more about uh, the hazards and the risk potential, ultimately to reduce uh, uh, p potential accidents and the consequences of those accidents.